Good morning, boys and girls. Today is what? Miss Terry, favorite day. And you know what that is, Friday. Today is Friday. All day long. Okay, let's do our song. And then we'll finish up with our days of the week. And we're going to do some counting today. You ready? Today is Friday. Today is Friday. All day long. All day long. Yesterday was Thursday. Tomorrow will be Saturday. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun. Today is Friday. Today is Friday. All day long. All day long. Yesterday was Thursday. Tomorrow will be Saturday. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun. Good job, boys and girls. Okay, uh, let me see who I call on. Kristen. I want you to do the days of the week. Let's do the days of the week. Okay, ready. We're going to do the one with days of the week. Mm -hmm. Ready. Count of three. One, two, three. The days of the week. Mm -hmm. The week. Mm -hmm. Okay, you ready? There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then it's Saturday. The days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and it's Friday, and then it's Saturday. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. Good job. Okay, let's do it. It's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Friday and Saturday. So Saturday is our what? Seventh day. See? Seventh day. So there's seven days in a week. Good job. Okay, this morning, um, the weather is what? It's cold outside. And it's also what? It's going to be sunny today. It's going to be sunny. But it is what? Cajun is what? cold outside it's still cold outside okay and we said the season was winter and today's weather will be sunny sunny and it'll be sunny and cold so today's weather will be sunny and cold we're outside outside and if it was cold inside, we don't have any wood on. We don't have any heat. Any heat on. Okay. And tomorrow we're supposed to be getting some more what? Snow. And so y'all can go outside and play in the snow. So I have a story for you. And it's called The Biggest Best Snowman. The Biggest Best Snowman. The biggest best snowman. <laughs> okay. Little Nell lived with Big Mama, Big Sarah, and Big Lizzie in the big house in the big snowy woods. Look at that. That's a big house. Look at all the windows they have. Let's count and see how many windows. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. We have thirteen windows. It's a big house. <laughs> big Mama, Big Sarah, and Big Lizzie had big busty voices. They had big talky friends. They had big loud parties. When little Nell asked, can I help? Big Mama, Big Sarah, Big Lizzie shook their head. No, you can't, they said. You are too, what, what you think they're going to say? You are too little. They might be in there. Big Mama, Big Sarah, and Big Lizzie. Yes, I can, say little Nell, and no. I'm not. No, you can't, they said. And yes, you are. 
she said, no, I'm not too little. And they said, yes, you are. One day, Bear Cub and one day Bear Cub said to Lil Nail, "Can you show us how to make a snowman?" "No, I can't," said Lil Nail. "I'm too small." "Yes, you can," said the animals. "And no, you are not." "But I'm so small," said Lil Nail. "My family won't let me do anything. I could never make a snowman." "How do you know unless you try?" asked Bear Cub. We will help you, little Nelson. Well, maybe she said. Mm -hmm. and she's sitting around the wood. That's going to be their wood table. And that's bear cool, the reindeer, and the hare. That's a rabbit. Little Nell got down on her knees. She carefully packed and padded and bed it the snow into a tiny ball is that what y'all did when y'all was out there making snow me did you kind of roll it pad it she rolled it and rolled it and rolled it to the reindeer the reindeer nudged it and nudged it and nudged it to the hair he's gonna nudge it and nudge it to the rabbit Rabbit kicked it and kicked it and kicked it to the what, bear cub. The bear cub rolled it and rolled it and rolled it until it stopped. And it was by the big icy pond. See, rabbit just kicked it and kicked it and kicked it and it went back down, up, down. So which way did it kick it? Did it kick it this way or did it kick it that way? Look at his back feet. He kicked it that way, down and up. And that bear, he what, rolled it and rolled it and rolled it. And that's at the edge of the pond. Now, what, asked Reindeer. The snowman need a miller, said Little Nell. How do we do that? Asked whoop, that rabbit. Little Nell bit her lip. She got down on her knees. She carefully patted, matted, and batted another tiny snowball. She rolled it and rolled it to the what? Reindeer. And the reindeer nudged it and nudged it to get to the what? The rabbit. And he kicked it and kicked it to get to the who? Bear coat. And bear rolled it and rolled it and rolled it until it came to a stop. And he pushed it on top of another snowball. Now, what he said. You see? It started from her. She rolled it and rolled it and rolled it to who? The reindeer. And he nudged it and nudged it and nudged it till he got it to who? The rabbit. And the rabbit kicked it and kicked it and kicked it until it got it to the bear cub. And then he put it on the on top of the other snowball. So now you got the bottom and you got the middle. Okay. It needed head, cried Lua Nia. She patted and matted and bedded another tiny snowball. Then she rolled it to the reindeer and the reindeer nudged it and nudged it and nudged it to the rabbit. And the rabbit kicked it and kicked it and kicked it to the bear cub. And the bear cub stuck it on top of the other two snowballs. You see? She what, padded and she matted and batted to the reindeer. And he nudged it and nudged it and nudged it and nudged it to the rabbit. And he kicked it and kicked it and kicked it and kicked it. They get to the bear cub. Now they got a bottom, a mellow, and a top. And which one is the biggest? Is it the bottom, the mellow, 
for the top, the bottom. Good job. Okay, let's do what. Lil Neil and the animals stood back and looked at the snowman. Something missing. The face, said Lil Neil. How do we do that? asked the animal. I think I will need help, said Lil Neil. She whistled for the birds to come. Crow, Cardinal, and Sparrow flew down from the trees. Could you make a face for our snowman, she asked. Crow fetched two pieces of bark for the eyes. Cardinal found an old pink sock for the nose. Sparrow brought raisins for the mouth. Little Nell handed her green scarf to the bears. They wounded around. They wounded and wounded and wounded around the snowman's neck. Then she added two sticks for the arms. The snowman was finally finished. Little Nell and the animals glared up at the creation. Wow, said the animals, and wow, said Little Nell. <coughs> She used her scarf for who? His scarf. She used the sticks for his what? Arms. Okay. It was almost lunchtime. Little Nell said goodbye to her friends. She walked home through the big snowy woods. Big Mama, Big Sarah, and Big Lizzie was waiting for her. Where have you been? They asked in a big busty voice. I was building a great big snowman, said Little Nell. How could someone as little as you build a great big snowman? Asked Big Lizzie. Come and see, Little Nell. Did they believe her? No, they didn't believe her. So Big Mama, Big Sarah, and Big Lizzie followed Nell through the Big snowy woods to the snowman. And what are they riding on? A what? A sleigh? And who pulling? Big mama. And look at this. If they couldn't see little Nia, what could they follow to find her? What did she leave so that they could find her if she got missing? Think about it. What are these? Her footprints in the snow. They can follow her footprints and find out where she's at. Okay. As they looked up, their mouth dropped open and their arms dropped to their side. Wow, they said. You built that? Yes, I did, said little Ned, with the help of my friend. That's the biggest, best snowman that I ever would, said Big Mama. Yes, it is, said little Ned. And Huge smile on her face. And they couldn't believe that she built that big snowman. Look. Will you come and help us make <clears throat> a big yummy lunch? Asked Big Sarah. No, she can't, said Big Lizzie. She's still too small. Yes, I can, said Little Nell. And no, I'm not. Yes, you can, said Big Mama. And yes, you will. So they finally decided to let her do something because they thought she was too small. But now, no matter how small she is, they know she can do it. Big Mama gave Little Nell a big sloppy kiss. Mooch. Big Sarah gave Little Nell a big squeezy hug. Ouch. And Big Lizzie stuck her big nose in the air. Huh. Little Nell friends lifted her to the top of the snowman. And Big Mama and Big Sarah were proud of Little Nell. Well, how about Lizzie? She still thinks she's too small. 
And why do you think that uh, the animals is lifting their little nail up to the top of the snowman? What's she going to put up there? Let's see. Hooray. She's still on top of the snowman. And she put a what? A candy cane and an ornament. Mm -hmm. So, this is what? The bottom, the middle, and the top. And the bottom is bigger so that the middle can sit on the bottom. And then the top can sit on the middle. And they use what for mouth? What was that? Raisins. They use the what for the nose? Salt. And they use what? Bark for the eyes. And what did they use for the arms? Branches. And the name of the story is The Biggest Best Snowman. And I hope you enjoyed the story.